So we decided to go on a cruise today. It is called the Quarantine Cruise, uh, the second one. And as of last night, I unfortunately didn't get to uh, film it, but on the 240, we got the windshield done. So that was a mad dash to get it there. And then all the lights, the headlights, the blinkers, everything like that, we were able to get that installed and working so we could come on the cruise. So um, I'll walk you around the car in just a minute we're at a stopping point about halfway and the car is driving amazing it feels great it's staying cool so success so far cruise I told you I was going to show you later the lights in working condition so I'm at the car now and here are the lights in the back we have our running lights which correction from from last video these lights down here they all light up for running lights and then they all light up brighter for brake lights and then we have our amber turn signals and our reverse lights wired in voila as Amanda demonstrates as a hand model Ka -chow. so they are in they're wired up the front I am currently painting the covers so they were on there uh, but you have your headlights and you have your blinkers and running lights Ka -chow. so they are all in wired up the only other thing I need to do of course we have the new windshield here that was installed, it was kind of a hectic ka -chow process. And uh, so I didn't film any of it. I have a couple pictures, but basically I called a bunch of places, last place in town, rushed over there, got it in before the cruise. As of right now, the last thing is a horn, and then we'll be ready to go. Uh, we got the seats in, the seats were already in, everything in the interior, ka -chow. It's working. I hooked the boost gauge back up for a vacuum gauge since currently we don't have a turbo. And then uh, change the uh, temperature sending unit to the gauge cluster. So it will be reading correctly. It was bouncing around and grounding out on the sensor. So been driving it now. Runs great. Stays cool. Uh, we had an idle issue fix that. So as of right now, other than a horn, we are almost there to the day we get this thing inspected and registered whenever the offices open.
So as you saw in this video, we put on some more stickers. So I have been meaning to do this. This is actually the old uh, font and logo for Travis Heath Racing. Um, but I had already had these cut um, last season. I just never got them put on. So this rear one, it went on okay. It's a tiny bit crooked, but honestly, the back of the car is a tiny bit crooked. So, but it went on good, as you saw in the video. I got the door, uh, driver door sticker on. I've had it on the passenger side and never just on the driver's side. So I just am cleaning it up a little bit today. I have a special opportunity uh, that I have been asked to do. And so you will see that in the next video. It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be fun. Um, so I'm kind of getting the car cleaned up for that. And, um, and then I will show you in the next video what I'll be doing with the 240.